Thousands of parents in Maine say the state's child care shortfall is the primary reason they're without a job. That's according to the Maine Center for Economic Policy. Parents are faced with wait lists or unreasonable travel times to reach the nearest facility to drop their child off for the day. People in the Rangeley area will soon have a new option close to home that community leaders hope will help build back the region's workforce. New Center Maine's Sam Olson reports. One nonprofit is working to open a child care center on this piece of land on Loon Lake Road in Rangeley. Today, the organization held a groundbreaking ceremony with hopes to start construction in October. It is, I think, probably one of the biggest things that is going to happen to Rangeley in the next five years. Community members and town leaders say this new $3.5 million daycare center will be life changing for families who struggle to find or afford daycare in the area. Some people work Monday, Wednesday, Friday because they don't have daycare Tuesday, Thursday. Um, others find that they can't work at all. The center will offer about 50 spots and has an extra classroom to potentially take on an additional 20 or so more kids. The nonprofit taking on the project, the Beth Brunswick Memorial Fund, says there are only three child care facilities in the area and only one of them takes kids under two years old. It was a struggle, not just for me, but all my friends at that time. This mother has lived in the area for more than 20 years. Her kids are now grown, but says she remembers struggling to find daycare when her kids were infants. During that till three years old, it was hard for us as a family. We have three children, so it was hard. We had to ask friends, grandparents, you know, it was hard. And the nonprofit says it's still hard all these years later. The center will take infants and kids through five years old. The center will be built near the Rangeley Lakes Regional School so parents with other school aged kids can have an easier drop off and pick up. The center and school will also collaborate on curriculums to help eventually ease young children into the school system. The Beth Brunswick Memorial Fund is still fundraising for the final $300,000 for the project. The nonprofit hopes to start construction this fall and hopes to open the center next summer. In Rangeley, Sam Olson, New Center Rain.